Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Blue and burgundy wherever you look, hymns ringing loud and proud. This is what it is to be in the Camp Nou. A mouth-watering game this between two very high-quality sides. A treat for everybody here. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. So it's down to business here. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? It's hard to overlook Gerard Piquet. He should be given a bit more credit, I think, for his performances. Anticipates well, imposed on the ball, and, and pretty good in the air. That'll all be needed for what's to come here, too. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. <laughs> Played it short. It's gone a long way up and away. Out to the left it goes. And Messi! Straight at the keeper. Messi might be slightly consoled by at least hitting the target. Now it's from Mario. Cruyff, he's got away. Dol Dolgleish hits it! And it's a goal! There is the breakthrough! Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. I doubt very much that this was in the script. Rakitic. Barcelona have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Vidal. Dembele, and it's Messi, and it's got through, going through, Messi, aimed long and direct, Cafu goes looking, Cruyff, Vieira, plays it forward, Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1-0. Belkleish has been... Maradona! Sticks it away! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Well, you've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very slim. Maradona is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. Things starting to look very comfortable. 
That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Cafu. Ronaldinho pushes it out wide. Maradona. Cruyff, Cruyff for the shot! Oh, it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line, very impressive. And it's been taken straight back. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. To look back on the first 45 minutes. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? It has been a remarkable contest, decorated by goals, and two between them at half time. So off we go once more. Has gone out. Coutinho has it out wide and in space. Messi cut out in the nick of time. Cruyff set up one goal so far. It's Doug Leash. Ronaldinho. Oh, good interception. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Well, they're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Cafu opts to play it back. Ronaldinho. Cafu. Crowd calling for him. Doug Leash hits it! They are rampant! And the lead is extended still further. Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. without reply this is becoming a stroll over to the left played into space out wide Messi regardless of the outcome it is good to see someone running at the defence like that attempts to play it through Ronaldinho a chance Danger averted for now. And he's going long. And through to the goalkeeper. Dembele. Dembele. He's onside. Oh, that's neat. Now the cross. Jordi Alba. Now it's Philippe. Goes for goal! Oh, that's a waste.
Vidal. Coutinho looking to get on the end of this. Defending was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. And it's Coutinho. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Ronaldinho. This is promising. Now it's Maradona. Maradona beats the offside trap. Ronaldinho. And he's cut it out. It's a loose ball. And it's the goalkeepers to claim. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? I think it's all about setting the right tone at the start of a match. And if you can back that up with an early goal, it just energises everybody, the whole performance. And I think they were certainly more fluid as a result of the early goal. So before we go, many thanks to Jim Beglin for his input. And from us both, good afternoon.